Hi, I'm Sean Gann, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to simplify a complex rational expression by writing it as division. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem here, we gotta simplify it. One third plus one sixth, all over one half minus one third. Now, the way I like to go about this here is I'm going to see if I can simplify the numerator and the denominator of the large fraction. But to do that, I had to find a common denominator for each part here. A lot of fractions here. Almost fraction inception. Well, I can make the one-third have a denominator of 6 if I multiply it by 2 over 2. So I have a one-third here times a 2 over 2 plus a one-sixth there, right? 3 times 2 is going to give me that 6 here. And reminder... 2 over 2 is just a 1, and we can multiply any number by 1, and it doesn't change it. That's why we can do this. The denominator here, the big one, we have 1 half minus a 1 third. So I have 1 half here minus a 1 third. What I'm going to do is multiply the first fraction, 1 half, by a 3 over 3. And uh, I can <laughs> put it over here, make a little more, keep it, well, consistent here, Sean. The second one third and multiply it by a 2 over 2. What does that give me? Well, I picked those numbers because it was the opposite denominator, right? 2 and 3 weren't the same, but 2 times 3 both gives me 6, the same denominator. Simplifying this out, 1 times 2 is a 2, so I have 2 here over 3 times 2 is a 6, plus a 1 6 over 1 times 3 is a 3, over 2 times 3 is a 6, minus 1 times 2 is a 2, and 3 times 2 is a 6 as well. Keep this simplifying here. We have 2 6 plus a 1 6. We, well, combine the underneath, we have 6 here. And 2 plus, oh, sorry, 2 plus a 1 6, sorry. 2 6 plus a 1 6 is a 3. We have a 3 6 here. Divided by, keep the fraction going. And 3, we have a 6 down here in the denominator still. And 3 minus 2 is a 1. Well, just like before, we have a big division sign separating two different fractions, so let's write it as such. 3 6 divided by a 1 6. Well, we know division of a fraction is the same as multiplication, so we have 3 6 times a 6 over 1, and this makes it so much easier to simplify. 6 is cancel here, numerator and denominator, and we have a 3 over 1, which is just a 3. And there we have it. When it's all said and done, our big expression with fractions here simplified to just be a 3. Well, I hope you learned something here on how to simplify a complex rational expression by writing it as division. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.